Hey guys, Unif Essentials here. For today's video, I'm going to be starting off with a round golden board. For this project, I'm also going to be using stem wires that I got from Michael's Craft Store. I'm using stem wires to come up with a design that is from a request. The wires will help me get the shape that I want for this design. I'll be making a pattern with these wires. I'll be having two different sizes in this design and I'm starting with a smaller size. I'll be using tape to keep them down on the board, but before that, I'm gonna be adding hot glue to make sure that they're firmly attached to the board. Now I'm going to go ahead to make the second set of patterns that's going to be larger than the first set that I had made earlier. Now I'm using stem floral wires because it's much stronger than the other regular floral wires. So remember, if you want to attempt this, you have to use a strong floral wire or any other wire that is really, really strong and at the same time easy to work with to make sure that your pattern stays in place when you're done. I'll be using bamboo skewers for this design and I'm using the shorter bamboo skewers to make it easier for me to get my design without constantly cutting. I'll be starting off with a smaller pattern here. The shorter skewers that I got are still too long so because of that I'm going to be using toothpicks for the smaller sides and then after that I'm going to be using the shorter skewers to finish up the remaining design. I'm done with the first pattern. Now I'm gonna go ahead to use skewers on the outer pattern. And the skewers are gonna be attached from the outside and touching the board that's in the middle. What you see me doing here is lifting up the outer design to make it look like there are two separate designs. And it works because I use floral wires that are easily adjustable. So basically I'm just giving a lift to the outer design I'm also going to be gluing down the skewers on the outer design to make it look like it has a bit of lift. When I was done with the back, because this is the back that I've been working on, I turned it over to the front. This is what I have. Now I took it out and I spray painted it gold, but covering the gold part in the middle, of course, so I don't ruin it. When it was dry, I glued a mirror in the middle and mounted it on a wall with a nail. 
to give enough allowance for the outer design and the wall. I used three packs of short skewers for this design and it turned out great. I really love how this turned out and I hope you all enjoyed this video as well. Thank you all so much for watching. I have other home decor DIY videos that are linked in the description box below to check them out and don't forget to click on the subscribe button.